Hello everyone, it's Unreal Shot and Easy, and today I will show you how to save settings. For this demonstration I will use the first person project, where I have implemented one setting. Let's start by creating a folder named settings inside the blueprints directory. Next create a structure called BPS settings. Next create a structure called BPS settings. Open the structure under the float variable named camera sensitivity scale. Remember to check the save game options for this variable. Also set the default value to 1. Now create a save game blueprint named SG settings. Open it. And add a variable called settings with the type BPS settings. Next, create an interface named BPI Settings Manager. Open this interface. Another function called Save Settings that takes input of type BPS Settings. Also add the function called load settings. Let's open the GI game instance blueprint. Replace camera sensitivity scale with the settings variable. Then add the BPI settings manager interface to the game instance class. In the Save Settings event, set the settings variable from input. Then check if the save game exists. Create a variable named setting slot save for the slot name. If the save slot exists, load the game from the slot, and cast the return value to SG settings. If it doesn't exist, create a save game object using the class SG settings. Now we need to set settings to save game object. and save it using the save game to slot. And repeat it. To avoid repeated code you can collapse the nodes from does save game exist to before setting of setting to variable. Remove connection before settings of settings. And select these nodes and collapse into a function named getSave. Open this function and add the two returning nodes. Then go back to event graph. Connect the remaining nodes to the save game part and remove the repetitive nodes. 
we've completed the implementation of Safe Settings event. Now let's implement the Load Settings. First check if the save game exists. If it does, load the game from slot. And cast it to SG settings. Save setting from save to a variable. Now let's update the API usages. Firstly open the menu class. In the event graph call the save setting function in the own value changed event. Create a setting structure with a camera sensitive variable and use it as an input for the function. Don't forget to update the binding of the slider. To do it, open the designer, select the slider and set game instance settings camera sensitive scale as a binding for value of slider. Next, open the player controller and fix usage of camera sensitive scale. Finally open the BP game mode blueprint and in the begin play event use the get game instance function to the get game instance and call load settings. With these changes everything should work as expected. Thank you for your attention and see you soon!